John L. Guidry Stadium has played host to many outstanding defensive backs. The likes of Ladarius Webb and Kareem Moore are more recent players to take their talents past the college level. Let's go back 30 years. That guy was Greg Greeley. Greg Greeley is the all-time interception leader and was recently inducted into the Nichols Hall of Fame. It was a great honor. I mean, I was uh, very excited to uh, receive that honor, Mike. It was a uh, very surprise honor. Uh, I really appreciate it. I'm grateful for it. And I think it's well deserved of me. Once drafted by the San Antonio Gunslingers of the USFL, Greg Greeley is now back and he has hung up those cleats and traded them in for whistles and clipboards. The ball hawking defensive back hopes he can bring some knowledge to the current players here at Nichols State. Uh, I think what you have to do on, from a coach's perspective is you have to be stern with them. You know, you have to be fair to them as well and you have to coach them up. You know, if you teach them the techniques, teach them the proper ways to run, tackle, block, do those things. And I think the players will respond to that. Football has grown more and more as each year passes. Player safety has become an important topic due to concussions and long-term effects of collision sports. Greeley talks about how the culture of the game has changed because of the player safety issue. From my perspective, it does take away some of the tackling rules or, you know, some of the excitement about tackling. But on, on the other hand, I understand that, you know, you, you want to be safe in playing the game. And, you know, I respect both the NFL and the NCAA and the high school level, you know, for, uh, for stepping out and, and, and wanting to protect the players. You may see the volunteer assistant coach roaming the halls and sitting in classrooms. A legacy on the gridiron and a Hall of Fame career, but the next step for the former player is finishing the college degree he once started. I really wanted to coach here, and my goal was to get back here to Nichols, finish my degree, which I had started, and I'm not far, I'm close now. So uh, it motivated me to get in this classroom now to get in that library and get this work done because I know I can do it. I knew I can do it back then, but I didn't prepare it properly. So now I'm more focused on my academics and I'm going to get it done and I'm really excited about being here. Many athletes may leave their school to play professional sports, but most don't necessarily return to that school. Greg Greeley is the exception. He's here and his main focus is trying to obtain that degree he once started. I'm Michael Hotard, NTW News.